Hello. Hi. Right. Um, basically, it's a new year, and we wanted to continue our tradition of being just really thankful for a lot of stuff. So uh, we we have a list of people that we want to reach out to and say thank you for supporting us. Um, Kaleido, you got fucking ace. Uh, Bug Bear, they booked us for the show that we have upcoming in London. Uh, Sam Heaton, one of the greatest dudes in Nottingham, oh, yeah. and has consistently been non-stop supportive to us, and it's meant the world. Uh, Jay Bowles, who has put up with entirely too much from literally all of us for too long. <laughs> uh, our producer, John Black, um, St. John. Yes. St. John, not one of these. Uh, <laughs> Alec Bondarev, and Conversing with Oceans. Um, and pretty much anyone from Jimmy Ryan's and the Bronx, New York, because we flew out there in November and had like a ridiculous time, and yeah, yeah. the whole thing was insane. It was wicked. It all came together by complete chance, it felt Way like, on our yeah. part. We were playing borrowed yeah. instruments. It was, everyone was really accommodating for us. It was a great time. The yeah. crowd was incredible. All the other bands were incredible. We got really drunk. <laughs> Speaking <laughs> of which, yeah, actually, I've got, I've got a shout out for, for Neil Leonidas, uh, Emily Small, uh, it, I think that it's their fault that one <laughs> like, oh. we one that we have a fan base and two that we were hung over for like oh, three days. Well. Um, <laughs> yeah. But like on top of that, like Brian Keith, yeah. which he couldn't not buy us drinks, yeah. and I love that guy. He was he was a hero. Sean yeah. Donovan was an amazing amazing singer, yeah. and uh, the band Durier, who are just the funkiest dudes on earth. I'm gonna to link to their music down below. They're incredible. I they're have just... their sticker on my pedal board. So yeah, I have one in my wallet. Still, they're, they're actually they're yeah. amazing. Um, moving on, we have <laughs> like Ned Roberts and our entire crew. He's another producer that we worked with, um, who works at the like the University of Surrey and com was just amazing. We had a really good day. A couple of days we were there for what 20, 23 hours in the course of two two days. Yeah, and he put <laughs> it was up insane. He, and yeah, he, put up with a lot. he put up with a lot, and I think we put up with a lot, but it was good. Like yeah. it was a real endurance test, mainly for him, oh, but also yeah. for us. So, <laughs> put it that way. Yeah, uh, so it was good trying to get from, uh, yeah, travelling back to London and coming back at the crack of dawn and be like, all right, guys, let's go. We've already been at it for an hour. So. Beauty lives here now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We have to thank Royal Beauty for moving back here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'd like to thank the band Red Mile. Um, they have been ridiculously like overjoyed about everything. Like They're just the yeah. nicest people, and yeah, we love you guys. Thank you they so much for your support. They're always up for drinking as well. So. Yeah, again, that's one of, the, one of those things where I'm like, hey, we had a great time. <laughs> oh, I'm so hungry. Uh, <laughs> check them out on Spotify oh, as well. Yeah, they say, yeah. Yeah. Listen. completely. Uh, Tess Yanakova, she has also put in an insane amount of work, same as Jade. Uh, like they got, They've been working together on something that we can't really talk about for a couple of months. Well, we did the same thing, it was weird. Well, <laughs> But um, they've both separately been um, a massive help, so it's a <coughs> big thing. Yeah. Uh, Adam Crafter from BBC Radio Bristol. I don't mm. think well, I could get away with not saying thank you to that guy. You're a legend, Thanks, Adam. Adam. Thanks, thank Adam. you. Uh, George Gad. Oh, George Gad. George Gad. George Gad. Oh, man. George Gad. George Gad. George Gad. Let's have a camera about George Gad. George Gad. Gad. I gather he's a pretty good guy. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, Jim Blackburn from Seattle. Jim, Jim, from Seattle. Jim, from Seattle. Jim from Seattle. Like, nothing we do could be possible without your support. <laughs> Jim, you smile. <laughs> You're a legend. Uh, Stuart Fox did our tour poster and did a fantastic job. And yeah, yeah. he managed to deal with us being divas about like, what we wanted <laughs> on the poster. And he was super good about it. And uh, yeah, I really appreciate it. Uh, Dave Stanley was another producer we worked with at the guys at Ruffle Audio in, in Nottingham. Check them out. Uh, so thank you, Dave. It starts with the tightrope EP, right? It was for the yes. tightrope EP, which, which came out in March. March. Tightrope day. Yeah. It's almost a year. We recorded now, that a year ago. We year recorded ago. it in December of 2018. Yeah. yeah. And yes. now it's 2020, that and that's just terrible. It was it was a funny that's one amazing. because we recorded literally all three of the tracks in one, pretty much one and a half days. Right? One and a half days, yeah. <laughs> it was we, crazy. We spent the first half second microphones and, and uh, yeah, I did not want to do yeah. the whole planet. I did not want any part of society after that. Oh. <laughs> We've got a couple of artists, we've got uh, Tom Johnson and Summer Fry, who, again, we can't talk about it for a couple of months, but they have submitted some absolutely ridiculously cool stuff uh, that we can't wait to show you. Um, <laughs> Bobby Turtles! Bobby Turtles! Enough, enough to have the guys, the guys are legend, thank you. He's a very cool guy. Um, all the guys at the mic, I mean, I'm going to give specific shout outs to Ben Sandro, Tristan Phipps, and Abby Clark. You guys have been nothing but supportive the whole time. We yeah. uh, somehow got voted as best band. 
for 2019 and that's that's a massive deal yeah we were very quietly very excited about the whole thing and uh, <laughs> we the, the right up that we received from that was was amazing and uh meant a lot yeah um, thank you uh, another thing that we can't talk about them uh, Martin Kaliev and his uh, video team. Um, you're a future legend, dude. Martin, you're right. All of you, you're future legends <laughs> for an unknown reasons. We, yeah, yeah. Um, no one knows. We know, but oh, they know. Not even I know now. I mean, we know so now. I mean, not now. Anyone who gets that reference, you've also got my thing. Yeah. Fans well, of Future. And on top of that. And Mitchell Ware. Mitchell Ware. And on top of that, anyone who came to shows and listened to us on Spotify and voted for us for this whole thing. That's probably the best part of this yeah. is is like we we played shows where there's been like one person in the crowd who's got it, and I think that's probably like the best moment is when like we had someone come up to us. We played a gig in Newark, and some guy came up to us. He was in his mid forties, and he was like, "I never dance, I never dance, but you guys got me up on your feet." Yeah. That was hands down the coolest moment I've I've had like so far. Yeah, just being able to connect with them, and so yeah. everyone who who came to shows and stuff. That's um, thank you. Uh, we've got way too much stuff going on this year, uh, and it's going to be nuts and kind of non-stop for us. So I'm really looking forward to it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for sticking with us. Uh, we have a lot more where, where that came from. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs>